Hey everyone, welcome to day two of the uncut... Ch Let me start that over, since I can't cut this. Welcome to day two of the crazy challenge in 7 Days to Die Alpha 20. We just got a bunch of stuff there. Art of Mining, we'll read that. We'll, we will wear the cloth armor because I can put um, pocket mods on it, but that's about the only reason. There's a weapons bag. The crazy challenge is basically... Engineering the Apocalypse's Uncut Challenge combined with Glock 9's One-Shot Kill Challenge. Let's start with One-Shot Kill. One-Shot Kill is you get hit by anything, just a little love tap, you're dead. That's the whole challenge, just to survive as long as you can. And the Uncut Challenge is... 20-minute days, hoard every night... Let's see, uncut episodes. Pretty much vanilla though, max horde. Max horde is a requirement for that. Okay, we have a bunch of stuff here. And vitamins really don't do me any good. This stuff really doesn't do me any good. But maybe we could sell it. Nah, I don't even think it's worth selling. We're going to leave it there for now. We're just going to make this our base. I did already search that, but I didn't hit the record button, so I wanted you to see that. Besides, it's just charred meat. So we're going to make this place our base. Because I was talking last episode about time management. And this is another time management thing. I'm not playing around looking for a base. I feel any place can be a base. It doesn't need to be way up, high up. It doesn't need to be buried way low. You can make your own. Anything of that nature, you're good to go. And I realize I missed some stuff in here. But this is this is home now, so it doesn't matter. What we're going to do is get back over to Hugh and turn in our job. And maybe, just maybe, take another one. Now, can I repair this? Yes. Because I will not use a pipe weapon other than a pipe machine gun. Well, you did uh, okay. I, yeah, I did okay. I survived. I get it. Yeah, thanks for the vote of confidence. Let's make a little bit of money. I'm not keeping that. Save my life. That's just too slow of a weapon for this challenge in my book. Um, that's good enough. Time to move on. Nothing is close by. I really rather do a fetch right now. Good luck. Now, did I check that over there? I'm pretty sure I did, but I've been in such a hurry that maybe not. Now somebody's going to say, see, you should have kept that pipe shotgun because I just got those rounds. No, I shouldn't have. No, I should not have. Now, I, I can definitely understand why you would feel like you have no time in the uncut challenge. Because that's, that's how it feels. It definitely feels that way, but you do have time. It's just not as much as you're used to or what you would like. Now, how do you get in? <laughs> it's through the back. I want to drop some stuff off. I should have done that initially, but I did not. Should just make a door out this way. I could probably hole up in here. Where's the good box? Okay. See, do... I have any stones on me right now? Wood. That's what I want to save. Um, let's bring along some to eat, though, and some to drink. Now, I should have done that at the beginning of the day. It would have been a better use of my time. That's how you manage your time, is by not forgetting to do that kind of thing, like I just did. Do as I say, not as I do. Now, honestly, I should have done that, though. I'm not going to tell you what I did was right. How is my water looking? Not great. So we'll take that. And... 
we'll chow down on that. Eat on the run. Now this is a fetch, and the reason I chose a fetch instead of a clear is because if I get into trouble, and I have the supplies, I can just book it. I don't have to stick around for anybody. And that's kind of what I want right now. Then I can get some experience, some rewards, some money. Oh, this makes this place actually makes a pretty good base. And I've used it several times over the years just because it's pretty solid. Now the problem is I don't have a lot of weapons. Now there's going to be zombies sitting out back here. Okay, I want to go around the other way. I don't really want to deal with Bo, though. Well, there he is anyways. See, I, uh, I'm much better at hitting the shot in the chest. <laughs> and the primitive bow kind of sucks, let's be honest. One arrow left. And that's why I didn't really want to deal with him, because I only end up with... Uh... Yeah, I have no feathers. I may have to bail on this challenge, or this job. Yep, I don't really want to play fisticuffs right now. So I need to take it nice and slow, make sure I have my stamina and all that. Make sure I have my stamina and all that so I can uh, kind of do, what does Jerudel say, juke him? We don't need that. We'll take that though. We will take that and all that. Hey, bunny. Hmm. Okay, I don't have any arrows, so that sucks. <laughs> oh, I should have kept my metal chain mod out. Can we sneak up on her? I doubt it. I don't even want to try. Okay, so we're doing okay so far. Let's just make a bunch of noise. Yep. Let's get them out here. Okay, we're dealing with this guy again. I should just build a ladder up to there. Can I do it? No, oh, let's see how many... They can make what? How many frames now? Nine. Let's go five. Um, main shapes. Ladders. Those are easier to see, I think.
Nothing else. We can get the main loot. We do not want to wear those boots. Okay, the main... The... I don't really want to face off against Mo. There it is. It's right there. We got the main part of the main loot. See you guys. This will be the rare time I bail on a job. Let's take both these frames back. There we go. <laughs> well, that made me happy. I don't know why. Kind of cheated that one, I feel. Okay, let's... Can we sneak on by? There we go. Really need to find arrows. Because that's my bread and butter. Or not arrows, but feathers. Okay, we got some feathers. We don't have much wood, though, either. Okay, after this, we're going home. We're going to hide ourselves in our bunker, I think, tonight. Maybe. We'll see how much time we have. Well, this is the Fates Motel. Yeah, I don't really want to mess around with that right now. No, it's almost 20 hundred. Before we start making arrows, we'll um, get inside the trader compound. Okay, we need more wood. No, I never would again. Ball cap mod. We'll take the Molotovs. So do we, can we get a job? We'll see you tomorrow. Okay, back home. 2020. And we got... Oh, we got five skill points. Maybe I never spent those. Holy crap, I never spent those. Well, look at that. I did all that without spending any skill points. I will get that done tonight, though. Um, I want to get up here. And there's not... Well, maybe I can. Now I guess I need one more down. Okay, let's try it here then. Alright, yeah, I need that one more down. Ask me why I shouldn't, but oh, they're on backwards. That would explain it. Derp. Okay, we'll just do it the easy way. We'll do this. Now tonight we may actually get a zombie or two. I don't have the required materials to fix it. Well, that sucks. I know how to get it, though. Problem is, with things like this, is that they, uh... There's lips on the buildings. We could always try running through the bunker and fighting them in there. Let's repair that then. Let's use that wood to make uh, more arrows. Uh, 
Okay, that might be the play, is to get into our bunker and let them beat up on the, beat up, beat down on that. No, not there. Not there. There? Yeah, okay. Okay. I kind of want to let them in. I kind of don't. I don't have any frames, so... Let's let them beat on some stuff for a minute while I try to get some wood together. Yeah, that's a little bit of wood. Make one frame. Good enough. I kind of want to let them in because uh, that door open, that's the door I kind of want to be open. It's easier to close. Didn't I grab it? I thought I did. Come on, I don't have enough wood to fix it. Oh boy. The guy wasn't here? Nope. That was lucky, I gotta tell you. That was pure, pure luck. And I'll take it. Shut that door. Get a little bit more wood. There's obviously still something going on. I do remember seeing Mo. Yeah, I should have kept that frame. Okay, do we get any more wood in here? A little bit. Okay, we're just gonna take a peek. For you guys. You coming, coming here, Mo? I hear you out there. There you are, Mo. Come on, you can do her. Whoa, talk about doing her. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, now he's here. No, oh, that will last us now. that crawling fucking bullshit. And we did it by 4 a.m. So anyways, this has been Panhead Gaming. This has been day two of the crazy challenge. I want to remind all bikers to ride safe and keep the shiny side up. I want to remind everyone else to live their best life. And I want to remind everyone, please thank a veteran or active service member for this service. They have earned your respect and gratitude. Have a great one. Now, oh, hey, are you coming for a ride with me? No? Then why don't you like, comment, subscribe, and share. And then, after that, why don't you think about going for a ride with me next time? I promise it'll be a lot of fun. You'll have a great time. But until then, have a great one.